it's been some time since we last reviewed a mini PC. Let's change that with the Ace PC Pico Box Mini review. First out of the box is the Ace PC Pico Box Mini, small enough to fit in the palm of your hand. We will take a closer look at it shortly. There is a user guide which is in multiple languages including English, German and French. Inside the cardboard packaging is a power supply. We will include the correct adapter for your country. Next we have a HDMI cable for connecting to your monitor or TV. And last but not least, there is a visa mount and a pack of screws for attaching to your display. The Ace PC Pico Box Mini measures only 3.52 by 3.52 by 1.71 inches and weighs 204 grams. The front keeps things simple with just a power button and power LED on it. On the left side are three HDMI ports supporting up to triple monitor display. On the back from left to right is the power supply, two gigabit ethernet ports and a 3.5mm headphone port. And on the right side are three USB ports for connecting peripherals to. The Ace PC Pico Box Mini uses the Intel N100 CPU, which has four cores and four threads running up to 3.4 GHz at 6 watts TDP. For RAM and storage, there is a choice of 16 gigs RAM and either 512 gigs or 1 terabyte SSD. For communications, there is Wi-Fi 5 and Bluetooth 4, as well as the two gigabit Ethernet ports. Whilst running the upcoming benchmarks, we tested the power usage, fan noise and temperatures of this mini PC. We got a very low 24 watts power usage, 53 decibels peak noise and 54 degrees centigrade peak temperature. For PC Mark, we got a great score of 3087. It's the highest in our budget range of mini PCs. You can see across the test that it is very good for heavier workloads, such as working with large office documents and even some image editing. For Geekbench single and multi-core benchmarks, we got a score of 911 and 2948 respectively. The score is impressive, beating our other lower cost mini PCs. And for 3D Mark, we saw good benchmark results with 360. It's not the highest score with the GMK Tech Notebook 7 coming out on top with 409, but it is above the rest. Not a bad score to be fair. The Ace PC Pico Box Mini can handle 4K video playback with no issues. We are playing a YouTube 4K test video and there's no frame drops at all. You can be assured that any 4K media will display exactly how it should. Whilst the Pico Box Mini is not a gaming mini PC, it is okay for very light gaming. We are testing the Olsen Double Dragon running at 4K and running at full 60 frames per second. Moving up a level with Ocean Horn 2, we are running at 720p on the low graphic settings. We are getting a solid 60 frames here as well, but do keep in mind the lower resolution and graphics levels. While setting up our mini PCs for review, we do have a general idea of what levels of emulation a device will support. The Ace PC mini PC actually surprised us with PlayStation 1 emulation. Not only does it run it great, it can upscale the graphics quality to 4K for far improved visuals. You can also play many games on the Dolphin emulator just fine. It's only when we get up to PS2 levels that we see less than ideal performance, around 30 frames per second for OutRun. Some lower demanding games will have faster performance though. And for PSP with PPSSPP, we get mixed performance depending on the game. On God of War, we can run it at full 60 frames per second with native resolution scaling, which is pretty impressive. On GTA Vice City, we see faster performance and can use 4 times up scaling for improved visuals. Time to sum up things now with our final thoughts. We saw very good scores in our benchmarks. It's ideal for your day-to-day -day workloads for the home or office, whether that be your child's homework or heavier tasks such as working with large documents. For gaming, it's not ideal. It's far from being a gaming mini PC, but you can play some light games and they work fine. Where we were very impressed was the level of emulation we could get out of this tiny PC. PlayStation 1 upscale to 4K resolution, Dolphin working great, and good PSP performance makes this a very tempting emulation box for your home TV. And for media playback, it is perfect. It is small and unobtrusive, and can be stored behind your TV for example. 
It is also quiet and won't make any noticeable fan noise whilst watching the film. For the price point, the Ace PC Pico Box Mini is a great value budget mini PC, and with its low power usage compared to say a desktop or laptop, it can save a lot of money on your electricity bills. It's definitely a mini PC to consider. You can learn more about the Ace PC Pico Box Mini and order yours today at droix.co.uk and droix.net. We are running sales throughout December, so take advantage and order yours today at a great price. That wraps up our Pico Box Mini review. We hope you have found it useful. Don't forget to subscribe if you have not already, so you do not miss our next video. Thanks for watching.